Hey there everyone, Ramesh here back again with another new brand course titled Functional Programming in Java. Well, are you looking to enhance your Java skills with a functional programming? Do you want to write a cleaner, more efficient and more maintainable code? If so, this course is for you. So this Functional Programming in Java course is designed to help Java developers transition from imperative programming to functional programming using Lambda expressions functional interfaces and java stream api by end of this course you will not only understand the theoretical foundations of functional programming but also gain hands-on experience with real world coding examples whether you are a beginner looking to explore functional programming or an experienced developer seeking to refine your skills this course provides everything you need to master java's modern functional programming capabilities so here let us quickly take a look into the roadmap for this course. So you will begin with understanding functional programming basics. Like you will understand what is functional programming, what are the pure functions in functional programming, what are the higher order functions in functional programming, what are the rules that make the pure functional programming. So once you will understand the basics of functional programming, next you will start learning the lambda expressions. So you will learn everything about lambda expressions with real time examples. Next, you will learn functional interfaces in depth. So I have covered all the commonly used functional interfaces. So you will learn function, functional interface in depth. You will learn predicate functional interface, supplier functional interface, consumer functional interface, by function functional interface, by predicate, by consumer, unary operator, binary operator. Next, you will also learn the primitive functional interfaces in depth. Next, once you learn the lambda expressions and functional interfaces, next you will learn the Java Stream API in depth. So I have covered everything about Java Stream API in this course. So you will learn the filter API with the real world examples, map API, plat map, sorted, collect, for each and distinct, limit and skip, count, min, max, any match, all match, none match, Next, you will learn Java stream programs. So this section I have specifically designed for beginners who can prefer further interviews. Next here I have added sections on Java collections framework as well. So you will learn the Java collections like array list, link list, hash set, tree set, hash map, linked hash map, tree map stack in depth. So you may have a question like why you have added Java collections framework related content to this course. Well. The Java stream API is heavily depends on Java collections framework. So you have to learn Java collections framework before learning the functional programming. Why learn Java collections framework before functional programming? Functional programming in Java often involves operations on collections, especially using Java stream API. Knowing how collections work helps you understand how functional programming manipulates the data efficiently. So I have added 7 plus hours of content on complete Java collections framework to this course. So before jumping into functional programming, master the Java collections framework first. And if you know the Java collections framework already, then you can skip these sections. Okay. So here are the reasons why you should learn functional programming. So using functional programming, you can write a less code. Lambda expressions and streams reduces the boilerplate code. Functional programming improve uh, readability. The functional code is easier to read and maintain. Functional programming boosts the performance. Streams allow parallel execution, making applications faster. Adopt modern Java practices. Functional programming is widely used in Spring, Spring Boot, Hibernate, and Java frameworks. Functional programming increases career opportunities. So companies seek developers proficient in functional programming. Well, functional programming is a future of Java development and mastering it will boost your Java coding skills and career opportunities. Whether you are a beginner or an experienced developer, this course will empower you with the knowledge and tools needed to write a better Java code. Start learning today. Join now and become an expert in functional programming in Java. Alright, great. I will see you in the course.